I'm Karina Medellin and welcome to the newest edition of Inside Bobcat Athletics. This Saturday, Texas State held its annual maroon and gold spring game. And we talked to a couple of players afterwards to see how it went. We're here with Adrian Ballard. And Adrian, talk a little bit about spring football in general. How's it going? Uh, spring football is a big thing. We're, it's a maroon versus gold thing. We take it very serious that whole week. We take it very serious. We practice with our teams, we always separate it, so we take it very serious and it's a big deal for us. Coach Fran talked a lot about the improvement that you've shown and how much success you've had during the spring season. What's the reason for that? New motivation? Oh, our new coach, I'll give it all to him. He, he stepped in, he didn't show that he was scared of nothing, he just stepped in and took control. He just showed us different footworks and I liked him, so it worked out very well. All right, and the goal team ended up winning today and it looked like the maroon team had it what happened what what got you guys the win tonight oh we all came together we knew the maroon team was talking trash the whole week so we couldn't let them beat us inside the 10 for the goal line did he get in he did touchdown maroon what a run from Chris Bell. we're here with david mayo david talk about spring football in general how's it going for you uh it went really well i think uh you know having a new defensive coordinator come in, Coach Thompson. It was a bit of an adjustment for the defense. I know the offense had, we're running a faster pace offense, so we had a lot to work on, but I think it went really well. We, uh, we got better. What do you think Texas State as a team has to improve on the most before opening day over here at Texas State? Well, I know as a defense, we gotta, we gotta stop uh, some big plays happening. You know, we can do well and then you know, if you have six good plays out of a, in a game and then six plays for touchdowns, that's, that's not good, you know. So we got we to gotta work on being 100%, uh, everybody doing their job, no letdowns, and, and uh, you know, hold, hold the big plays back. And on offense, they're doing a really good job, you know. They're just got, they just got to keep building on what they're working on. All right, thanks so much, and we'll be right back on Inside Bobcat Athletics. We got Bobcats on three. Bobcats on three. One, two, three. Bobcats. Get your Bobcat season tickets today. Call 512-245-2272 or go online to www.txtbobcats.com slash tickets. Softball individual tickets are available online, over the phone, or at the box office. We'll see you at the ballpark. Well, that's the good thing about this game. Now. Welcome back to Inside Bobcat Athletics. We're here with Craig Mager, and Craig, just talk a little bit about spring football. Oh uh, man, it's been a, it's been an amazing experience, man. This is my last spring uh, experience that I'm gonna have in college, man, and. Uh, it was fun working with all my teammates, man, and uh, they really got better this spring, man, so it's great to see what they're going to bring to us in the fall. What has been the biggest improvement you've seen as, as a team for Texas State this spring? Um, definitely our hustle, man, our will, our want to win, man. You can tell that the, uh, the work ethic around the team is, is real fun, and uh, everybody's really enjoying themselves, man. So uh, definitely our work ethic, man. We're working really hard, man, trying to get the new defense down and stuff, so I'm really proud of these boys. It looked like the Maroon team was going to take the spring game. What happened? What did uh, it, the coaches tell you anything? Oh uh, well, yeah, man. The coaches told us at halftime, man, that uh, they they wanted to win this game, man. So uh, the the boys really brought into what our game plan was in the second half, man, and uh, we pulled it out by one point. It was pretty nice. So is this going to give the goal team bragging rights oh, next yeah, practice? De definitely, definitely. The, the Maroon team won't hit the end of this for the rest of the season until next time we play. So it's pretty great. Uh -oh. My ball is out. I'm here with Zach Falaquette. It's after the spring game where the goal team actually won 30-29. Zach, talk a little bit about the game today. How did it go? 
Uh, it was very exciting. I mean, everybody came out and played, you know, their best. Uh, obviously, we all improved. I think every, every practice, you know, learning a new defense and stuff, you know, new defense coordinator, I think we all looked really good out there. Right? In offense, we, you know, saw some plays and stuff. So I think it'd be really exciting uh, 2014 season. So Was there a lot of trash talk leading up to this game? Yeah, I mean, there always is. I mean, there's, you know, Everybody wants to beat everybody, you know, it's, uh, but in the end, you know, we're all just one team and stuff. So, you know, congratulations to the gold team. But, I mean, we're all, you know, together now, so we're just going to have to all look forward to the fall season. And what do you think Texas State as a team has to improve on before uh, season starts? I think just playing four quarters. I mean, like I said, you know, we, we start off the Maroon team today, you know, start off bad, and then we play good second, third quarter, and we let it go at the end. Uh, I think there's been games – Last year, where we start off good and we finish bad, and then we start off bad and finish good. I think if we can just play all four quarters, I think we'll be all right. All right, well, thanks so much, and good luck this season. Four-man rush here. Price's throw is caught and deflected by Miller. I'm here with Damon Mercer, and Damon, just talk a little bit about spring football in general. How's that been going for you? I feel like spring football went pretty good for me. I mean, I learned a lot of stuff from making a transition from quarterback, from playing quarterback in high school to moving to receiver. So spring football, it's been pretty good. This year. And what did you think about today's game, spring game? Congratulations, goal team ended up winning at the end. What happened there? Well, we had to uh, we had to go ahead and pull it together. I mean, we knew what we was lacking in, what areas we was messing up in. So coach kind of gave us a little pep talk coming out of halftime and kind of gave us a little edge. What did you think about the turnout today? Was your family able to make it to watch you play tonight? Yes, I had a, actually I had a big crowd. Family, <laughs> my family, a bunch of them came out to support. They actually waiting for me right now, so it was good to see them out here today. All right, we'll let you get to your family. Thanks so much. That's it for this episode. Thanks for watching. I'm Karina Medellin for Inside Bobcat Athletics.